So, this is my first vlog since being back from the Caymans. I got some updates for you guys. I posted a photo on Instagram like when I got back and I had some people like, oh my gosh, you know, I wanna look like that after 19 days, vacation, blah, blah, blah. And I was like, here's the situation. Here's what happened. I went to Caymans, I was drinking, I was eating, I was living my best life. My weight was like up and down. Like I, I gained a good amount of weight. Like I don't know exactly how much I was kinda like, and Christian was like, yeah, you look full. I was like, yeah, I do. Towards the end of the trip, you know, me and Christian started tightening up again. We're like, okay, let's start training again. We're slobs. So we started working out a lot. We started eating healthier. Body's coming back, all good. And then I got sick. And when I say sick, I mean, this knocked me on my ass. Basically, I came down with tonsillitis. I've never had tonsillitis. It was disgusting. My whole throat was white and then it turned black and it was just like gross. On antibiotics, steroids, I was like bedridden. Like I had no energy. And so I couldn't really eat. So then my weight dropped. But when I first got sick, it said I weighed 117 pounds because my whole body was like inflamed. And so that means I gained like 10 pounds, which is a lot for my little body. That happened and then I wasn't able to eat for a couple days. So my weight has been all over the place. Between vacation and getting sick, I feel like I'm starting over. I'm not, but we are grocery shopping today. We're gonna, we're gonna put some food together. We're gonna work out. Turn our life around. Scale's upstairs, let's go. You got this. Oh, uh, <laughs> okay. Let's see how much I weigh. I'm so winded. So about 112, 111, 1.8 slash 12, close enough, whatever. One, 112, that's not bad at all. That's, I, I feel like my weight was up and down. Now it's like kind of like back to normal. But I do feel like I lost some muscle mass and maybe you know, gain some fat because I wasn't training as hard as I normally do. I'm gonna drink my protein shake chill and then we're gonna go on a super secret mission. We've been looking for an office space for a while now. B, 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 B! No, no, you're not trapping me out here. Hello? There's B. No, get in. Run, run! <gasps> Left, I do really want this spot, so we're gonna go look at it. So. I'm so that, excited. There's a leg work right there. <laughs> Well, I feel like we could just stare at it for 15 minutes. <laughs> that's how much I want this place. Okay, let's just go wish it. Let's go us. wish it. Let's go pray. Let's, let's go bow. It. Let's go like... What's that? Oh, we gotta rub it. We gotta bend the knee. We gotta bend the knee. <laughs> I went to go look at this spot and it's, it is perfect. It's everything I've ever wanted. Everything I've ever wanted, but someone else might get it because I was a little bit too late. They, literally they were like, if you would have came in a week sooner, it would have been yours. Right now there's a chance, but I would say it's like 10% chance that I could actually get it. Anyways, grocery shop, which I'm really excited about. Christian gets back today. Um, he gets in in like five hours. So I'm, I'm trying to get like, the house super organized, put together, full freaking fridge of groceries. And so he's gonna come home and be like, wow, I'm never leaving again. <laughs> Let's do this. We're getting coffee first, I can't do this. It's a chicken wing, basic. Hi, can I get a cappuccino? Let's do this. down to you and what I got. These are like the protein meat options that I have. Some organic fresh chicken breast, some lean ground beef, it's 93.7, Christian's favorite. Some stew meat, that's my preferred, my preferred 
like red meat. It's a little bit higher in fat, but it tastes so much better. I got a rotisserie chicken because this is nice to just have on hand. It's like an already made chicken. So sometimes while I'm unloading groceries, I'll, I'll kind of like throw some rice in the microwave or grab some out of my thing and I'll just kind of eat while I'm putting the groceries away because I'm always hungry. Some egg whites, I just got 100% egg whites, full on eggs. For fruit options, blueberries, this is for Christian. This is one of his favorites. I got him some raspberries and pineapples. I also got him some grapes. My fruits that I like to have are fresh oranges, watermelon, mandarin oranges, cucumbers. Are cucumbers a fruit or vegetable? Is that a stupid question? I don't know. Comment down below. Tomatoes are fruit, and I got tomatoes. <laughs> For vegetables, I got some red and green and yellow bed, bell, bell, bell. <laughs> I got mixed bell peppers, veggies. I got a Mediterranean blend. I got some whole leaf spinach. I got some, I thought this was really cool. This is my first time seeing it. It's mixed rice cauliflower blend. So it's a cauliflower, it looks like rice, with some bell peppers and onions. So it kind of gives it that stir fry vibe. Cilantro. I got some Italian salad. I got some baby spinach, zucchini, cucumber, fresh basil, fresh rosemary. Pico de gallo, my favorite. I also got this like corn pico because it's got black beans and corn. So it's like more filling than like, this is like, Nothing, it's like tomatoes, nothing. This, it's got black beans, it's got corn, it fills you up a little bit more. This is my favorite cheese, spicy cheese. It is not low fat. This is full on cheese and it's delicious. Christian's like, ew, gross. You just sit there and like just eat your cheese cubes. I'm like, yeah, yeah, I do. But for him, I got low moisture, part skin mozzarella cheese. And then, so I like noshi, is that how you say it? Ganochi, ganachi, ganasi, ganahi. Nochi. I'm so confused. What? Nochi. Okay. I got sweet potato nochi. I thought this would be a good thing to try. Also got some regular potato nochi. The bread, I got whole wheat sandwich bread. Nothing crazy. We, me and Christian don't eat a whole lot of bread. Uh, some corn tortillas though. We like, we like some tortillas. So I'm definitely probably gonna make some fajitas or something. And then this is kind of like the snack area. This is just kind of like, like little random finds. I got some salsa, obviously, because who doesn't need salsa? Uh, these little broccoli bites. I think I showed this on my channel or on my Instagram at least one time. Really good. Not like amazing. It's just like not bad and you get it, you know, your broccoli in there, so it's good. Got some Halo Top, I really like the cookies and cream. Got some of these like quick, I think these are vegetarian, vegetarian burritos, like little quick breakfast things. Got some purple chips, I always get these, you guys know me. Got some coconut oil and sea salt. This is like one of my favorite yogurts. Also the Chobani lime, my favorite. For some reason Whole Foods doesn't carry it. Get your life together, Whole Foods. Kill my vibe. Got some green tea peppermint because I'm turning a new leaf Get it? Nah. I'm trying not to drink coffee anymore. Oh God, I had one this morning. We're getting coffee first, I can't do this. I'm trying not to drink as much coffee anymore, so I substitute in with green tea. But I heard green tea has more caffeine. Is that true? That's a lie, that is a lie. There's no way green tea has more than coffee because everyone would drink green tea. Also got some rice pudding. I love these, these are really good. They have four grams of protein in each like little thing, so not a crazy amount, but better than nothing and they taste delish. Next thing, I got a few condiments to kind of cook with at the house. One that I thought was really cool, I've used, I've been using this for a while. It's liquid aminos. So while you're cooking, it's kind of like a soy sauce flavor and you're gonna get some amino acids in there. I'm trying out this steak sauce. It's a sugar-free organic steak sauce. Thought that would be really good with the steak cube. Sweet chili sauce. I thought this would be really good on like chicken, rice, kind of make, make our own, I don't know, something. I'm gonna experiment. I like to experiment at home. Got some barbecue sauce. I tried to find like a lower sugar one or something and I couldn't find anything at Whole Foods. So Whole Foods, get your life together. Hopefully this is good. Sugar-free syrup, just like a teriyaki, less sodium thing. That is it guys. Oh, wait, 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 one more thing, sorry. Manuka honey, I got this the other day, but I'm pretend that this was part of this. I've heard a lot of good things about Manuka honey. So when I had tonsillitis, everyone was like, oh my gosh, put some Manuka honey on. I was like, what, y'all are so weird. Anti-inflammatory, I'm still reading about it. I just kind of heard about it. There's a lot of amazing benefits to this. So I'm definitely gonna be doing some more research. I thought I would buy some, I don't know if I can, cause I'm so allergic to pollen. I don't know how I'd react to like this super crazy, like raw Manuka honey. You wanna try some? Here, try a little lick. It just tastes like it's honey. not bad. This is just like a regular honey. It's a little bit thicker. So Manuka Doctor is where I got this from. There's supposed to be like all these crazy benefits to this. This is my grocery haul. Make sure to give the video a thumbs up. We're gonna put all this away and then work out, go to the office, and we're gonna organize the pantry and closet today. That'll be fun. Thank you, bye. I got my baby back, my bus mobile. They had to replace the door 
and this uh, tire cover. So that got replaced. I just have to paint this. So because everything on my car is actually uh, blacked out. So when I got it, I made sure that they painted everything black. So the rims, everything. Let's go to the office. Hi. Oh, Andy's here. Hello. Oh, God. Hey. Hey. Fun fact, I think you guys already know. I get very nervous when there's balloons. Is that balloon phobia? Is that a thing? Balloon? No. Yeah, no, it definitely is a thing. I don't know what the tech come from. <laughs> Why was it on me? It's just a, I forget what they're called. <laughs> Bring this agent, I need to be blessed. It was a worm. No, it's with like legs. A, with a little pointy thing. Like a little centipede. Like a mini no, it's like oh, a, a, it's a silverfish. No silverfish, that's what it is. Nothing that was not a fish. <laughs> oh my god, Heidi, you almost died. I almost died. Ooh, YouTube title, almost close to death. This close to death. We hit 300K on Buff Bunny Collection Instagram. Super exciting. And Kayla was like, let's do something cute. Let's hold 300K in balloons for a photo and I was like balloons are terrifying but we'll do this as long as it's a group effort so we're all gonna take a photo outside these beautiful terrifying oh. balloons we're conquering fears today that's spin it spin. no fear will be conquered fears conquering what you, fears what you doing Heidi? You know, Heidi uh, conquering fears that's Heidi you got right. this you're conquering all your fears today <laughs> yay 300k oh god you're okay you're okay oh, I'm gonna die you're doing amazing push this, sweetie. Push few minutes later okay so we're about to go work out I am bloated and cramping but it's okay we're still gonna train because we have turned a new leaf but I'm gonna go do a leg workout and I'm gonna use the new bands that are releasing we haven't really picked a day yet but I will announce it here because by the time this uploads I'm sure we'll have a date picked in mind we are releasing black as well as a custom marble print as well as our beautiful, this is like a mature blue color. Some features about these bands, I'm just gonna show you real quick. We have the silicone branding, so this isn't gonna come off. It's on there. This is the medium size. We have three sizes. We have small, medium, and large. Another feature that I really like about these bands, I don't know if you guys have any that don't have this, but this makes a huge difference. A lot of times when you're using these bands, they kind of slide up and down. We made sure that they have these two strips that they stay in place. So instead of slipping like this, you have this on here, it's like, it's not going anywhere. Definitely a key feature when it comes to having glute bands. Some of the best quality bands I've ever used, just saying. So once these are gone, they're gone. Let's go work out. What's going on guys? Welcome to the workout part of the vlog. First of all, I wanna apologize because while I was looking over this like footage and you know making little tweaks to the video, I realized that I was in such like a, I was like like a little grumpy cat like this whole video because I was like cramping and bloating and I could just see to my face, I was like, why do I seem so like irritable? So sorry about that, but this is, you know, my vlogs are real life, definitely real life. First day of my period is not fun. Um, but okay, so let's get into this workout. So the beginning here, I did a couple different stretches and a couple different exercises just with body weight, just to, you know, get the blood flowing, get the muscles nice and warmed up. And my whole workout today, I ended up using a glute band for the whole thing. I wanted to show you guys different ways that you can use the bands, but also I really enjoy using my bands. I am so obsessed with them that even before I came out with mine, I would, you know, use one. I took one with me to the Caymans. I, you know, if I went home to visit my family, I usually brought one with me because I truly feel like it helps me isolate more of my glutes when I do squats, when I do lunges, when I do toe touches, like I feel it more so in my glutes. Because me personally, I am top heavy first of all, so my upper body builds more easily than my lower body. And also when I do lower body, my legs, my quads, my hamstrings kind of take over versus my glutes. So that is just me. But uh, using bands are great because if you travel a lot, they're easy to just throw in your bag. If you, you know, you're a stay-at-home mom, you can do all types of exercises with these bands. Something that I also did with my glute bands is that I have a downloadable program for free that come with all the bands. So whenever you guys purchase the bands in your confirmation email, there'll be a link and you're able to download this free program with you know workouts and little tips on how to use your band with photos. So it actually shows you how to use the bands, different ways to use the bands at the gym or at home. And I just 
I just thought that would be really important so you guys know how to use them. Also, just wanted to mention, I am not trying to sell you guys my bands. You guys maybe already have a band at home. Maybe your gym has these bands that you can use for free. Maybe your best friend has a, has one of the bands and you can just use hers while you work out together. But I just wanted to show you guys different ways to use them and say that I think they are awesome and such a great tool. And I hope you guys enjoy this workout, seeing different ways to use it. Thank you for listening to me ramble on in this voiceover and I hope you enjoy the rest of the vlog. That's enough of that guys. Got a protein shake because I was starving. I didn't have a shaker cup. I was trying to make the one up one. <gasps> Let me just show you real quick. I'm just so excited. One up came out with this new freaking delicious it's cotton candy. It's unreal. It's actually really good. I was really excited to try it, but I was in the Caymans and I couldn't try it. And then I was like watching everyone else's reviews. And I'm like, ugh, because like cotton candy is so sweet. And so at first I was like, it's gonna be really gross. But I would give it like a, I would give it like a nine, because it's more of like a vanilla y flavor with very small hints of like a, like a blueberry or something. But it's really good. So I stole it from the office and I'm taking it home. We're gonna go to Chipotle because I need a full on meal. This is gonna fill me up. It's like what, 160 calories? Not nah, time to eat. <laughs> I got the goods. I ever get so hungry that I can't think, can't function. You just have to eat a little something like, before you can move on with your life. Look at me right now. I just need a few chips. I got Christian a bowl because he gets in here. He gets in like less than an hour, so I got his food all ready for him. And I got tacos, tacos. But I'm like, pretty sure he used flour tortillas and wanted corn, it's fine. Get one bite in, ready? And y'all are always like, Heidi, you don't swallow your food. Like you show a bite and then you don't swallow. So make sure you show me swallow. Cause people are weird. So in my tacos, I get a little bit of white rice, a little bit of black beans, chicken, pico, a little bit of cheese, a little bit of lettuce. It's, it's, I, I think it's just say a little bit of everything just so it all fits in this taco. Wow. This is dedication. You gotta, got mm -hmm. you. We're gonna debunk this myth that you don't swallow. Wow. Every last bite. I'm also a very slow eater. I'm just very slow. So I'm gonna enjoy this. It's time to organize. There's probably things growing in here. I don't know the last time that we cleaned this out. So wish us luck. We're cleaning out the pantry. Papa Kuzman came in at the right time. Look at, we hooked him up. Look at all that, that's all. I just came to uh, Christian's ATB, Heidi's ATB, and we got stocked in our shelves. Look at that, Ooh, popcorn. Everything right here. I got it for the whole year now. <laughs> you don't have to go to GNC ever. Never. I was so like so proud of my son when, he, when I, his name was on the first I bottle. Know. I got the first, right. the first bottle. I got it up in my closet and it's like right there Aww. with all my other collectibles that I have from him. This yeah. first church. I mean, all I did was bring Nala and this is all I got. Wow. We are so thankful for bringing Nala that we had to. <laughs> Ooh, man, I'm going so low. I'm going. I'm loaded, dude. <laughs> Heidi, thank you so much. So Kayla and Jossie are working on the pantry downstairs because, you know, but we're trying to get this as clean as we can before Christian gets here. So we have to fix up this, this closet. So yesterday it was a mess, but I actually organized quite a bit since I've been here. And uh, we're gonna keep going. So. <laughs> all like the oats, quinoa, bread, you know, stuff. This is all pasta and rice because Christian, it's all he eats. It's like 95% of his diet is pasta. Got some canned stuff, condiments. This is like the snack area. This is like our one up and ghost area. This looks really sad now that we've cleaned it out. Mostly everything is expired, gross, but 
Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and end the video because I feel like we have a good amount of stuff in this vlog. So, <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed it. I am gonna do a giveaway for this video. I'm gonna give away five downloadable programs. Whatever you guys want, all you have to do is give the video a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe to the channel and comment below your favorite part of the video. And that's it, guys. Thanks for watching and uh, love you guys. See you next video.